hello guys it's me Karthik. hope you guys are doing really good so in my previous two videos on apache artemis we have seen how to install and how to run the server how to set up the spring boot application right so in this video we are going to see how to send the message to the uh, queue okay in active mq artemis that part we'll see and in the next video we'll see how to receive that message from the queue okay so as i explained in my previous video i have taken the two projects sender pro sender application and the receiver application so we are going to do the changes in the sender application now okay so this is my project as you could see here there were two packages i have added one is a controller the next one is a service the purpose here is from the api when i try to hit this uh, api it do some some you know some some activities that business activities it needs to then it will send a message to the queue okay those business activity as of now will skip because it is again depends on your project requirements but we will send this message uh, which we are going to you know put it from the api into the active mq uh, queue okay and we'll see how to see that in the application so i am at the controller now we will create a message something like send our controller this is my controller so now as i said it is a rest controller right this is my rest controller let me take get mapping at the rate get mapping here value is equal to let's say like value is equal to uh, send message right this backslash will be there uh, I forgot let's see public void let's say send a message i think the black shirt should be there let me keep something like q dot send a message here yeah. send a message of um string message okay here let me put one sys out like message is and this one will come to me as a um, parameter right so request param as message from the api only we will take this and we'll keep this as a string message okay now this is the first part is the basic part okay now let's go to our service part and let's say like send a message service we'll create a class Set service this part as service now let me auto wire this activate auto wire send message let me keep something like msg service import auto wire then import the class here okay cool okay now here this is the important one so basically what we are doing is we are going to send the message how to send that message for that there is a library called jms template jms template jms template okay this is a part you need to auto wire okay now here let's say public void send message msg will take okay string as 
message okay here simple guys jms template dot here you have convert and send this is correct right if you see here this option here it is asking for two things destination name and the message message is nothing but this one and the destination name is nothing but the queue name okay here let me take public static uh, string destination as let me take learning as my queue name okay this destination i am going to put here cool so basically let's add one sys out here like message sent in queue queue okay q u e u e q okay just a minute guys i'm getting a call here we are basically whatever the message we are getting from api we are converting and sending into the into the active mq uh, queue with the, the so here the queue will get created with this name learning if it is already exist then it will just pass the message if it is not there then it will create a queue right now let's call this guy from the controller so simply send message dot here send message whatever the message that we have sent okay cool right now where this is running this is running it 7856 now let me start my server I think this should be there. Seven eight five six. Let me start again because there is a the small modification I did. So now simply go to the postman. and try to send a message from the get api okay and see whether that message is being sent into the queue of active mq artemis okay so before to that make sure that artemis is running fine okay here a session got expired guys and uh, so what i will do is first I will run the session again and hopefully here it is started executing cool now the session is starting now you could see now so let me log in here admit admin okay so my user id password now you could see there were no queues got created as of now okay now let me run this server sorry let me execute this api api is running it sender one is running it 7856 right 7856 then the actual endpoint is this is the actual endpoint q send message q send message then the parameter okay as a message let me say like hello world okay ensure again all of them one more time get mapping Q send message and request param as a message 
and that we are sending to the uh, JMS template and this will convert and send to this queue learning queue with this message right let's execute this and see now you could see in the server now you could see message sent to the queue right now let me just refresh this again now you could see we got the landing successfully got created this one right now let's go here go to uh, browse queues this is the one right show message now you could see this is the one right hello world let me send one more value hello world one two three there should be one more entry okay move back refresh a bit the second entry should be there now you could see the second entry is there right so this is how you can you know send a message to the queue from active mq artemis using spring boot hope you guys like this video if you liked it don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel thank you so much for watching it's me karthik signing off